Hey, welcome. I've just finished another great trading session. I've started with just one dollar. If you want to find out the result where I got with this small amount to, to what amount I got in the end of profit, watch this video till the end. Don't forget in the description to this video, you'll find a my personal promo code for you to use when you deposit. It gives you 50% to your deposit. So make sure to use that. Let's start right now. I'm all over. Let's go. Right guys, we're gonna start with a first option. It's gonna be a put option and I'm only using $1 today. Let's find out where I can get with this amount. But basically here uh, we see that um, the, um, the amount, um, the amount uh, that we place is really small that we are expecting it to grow by using a compound percentage and the decision um, making here is that we see that MACD was was um, about to cross the slower line which is which happened now you can see that and that's the decision and then you got a, a downtrend forming zigzag is looking down and we have crossed through in the Keltner channel through the middle that's another indication so everything was for a put option i think we're in yes and we got our first profit i spoke through the whole minute and let's move on with the next uh with our next option we'll we'll, we'll keep uh, because we don't have it's 191 we have we'll just keep going with one dollar and then we can move on Right, so what's happening here, we see that there was a, a bullish absorption, so that's a good sign, that's a good impulse, so therefore a call option for one minute, and let's wait for the result and continue. And here is another profit from this option, it's not huge, but we're, we can place now $2, so let's move on guys with our next option and like using the compound percentage basically um, from each the profit from each option we're placing it towards the next option in case you don't know but most of you guys know that i use this every time um, that's a really nice situation here we got a strong upper trend going on and Although we got to a point where we could probably catch a pullback. Let's try to catch a pullback because at this point it got out of the channel. So it, it likely it will come back in, in, into the channel at least. So basically we're trying to catch a pullback at this point. So let's wait for the result and continue. And here is the profit from this option. Not a huge again, but we are now able to place a four dollars. Let's have a look. Um, so we're gonna place four dollars towards the next option, and let's find out. Let, let's find this. Uh, I like to switch between the assets and find this perfect scenario. Right, four dollars and let's look for it by the way guys don't forget to like subscribe and comment this helps channel really really well um so i've been told so that'd be great if you can guys spare a second right let's make this put option over here we got uh, pretty much everything like pointing to towards a um a bearish mood so a, a put option but in this case it looks like um this is a pullback so we enter well not at the top because it's moving further up but we entered in the pullback so the 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 idea here i think is that it's going to go back up for, so by the time our option finishes it would go in for this pullback and then go back down um, yeah, what did I say? It, it should go back down, not up. 
So yeah, let's wait for the time that's left. I don't think it's much. 10 seconds. Okay. Um, and let's see. Wow, we're, it's risky. Oh, looks good. Yeah, so it started going back down. And we got $8 on the balance now, so we can place the $8 towards the next option. Okay, um, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Do, 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 do. $8, and let's place. Let's switch to the next. One and huh, we got to a resistance there. So let's go in with a put option because um, as we reach the resistance, we are likely to to basically to bounce off it because it, it it resists and we bounce off it. Um, maybe for a pullback. That would be good for us because we only have one minute time. So yeah, let's wait for the result and as always continue. There we are guys, we got the profit from this option and it's getting into small two figures, it's $14 that we can place towards the next option. So. That's pretty good. Um, we're moving pretty fast as you can see. That was 86% payout. This one has 92, for example, that's a bit better. Uh, well, that's whole uh, 6%, it's not too bad. Sometimes they go pretty low. Sometimes they go down to 70 something. And you might find yourself, um, uh, that's looking good downtrend in full and we enter into the put option here with uh, I mean at at a point where kind of at the top of the pullback which is great so that's what we want so let's wait for the result of this option and continue and here it is let's let's put straight away 27 dollars that we can place towards the next option looking really good by the way guys i uh, i forgot to mention about a telegram group where you can learn about trading uh, the link is going to be in the description to this video the invitation link if you want to find out more about technical analysis indicators oscillators and just stuff in general um, for binary options or any any trading really it applies this knowledge is universal so yeah make sure to check that out and let's move on let's move on with this one here that looks like a nice indication for for us to go with a put option MACDs sh clearly showing um, a put option indication and also we have um, we have reached the resistance level there and it's, it looks like it's bouncing off. It's going to test the middle and maybe it's going to go through the middle actually at this point. It has all the uh, possibility. But let's wait for the result and see for ourselves and then continue. Here is the profit, guys. We're in fifty dollars already. It's been uh, not 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 long. It's been twelve minutes, and we're in with uh, fifty dollars. I'm gonna place fifty-two dollars towards the next option. And it's not bad, although we started with just one dollar. You can see that you can you can get some nice um, nice amounts here. And let's move on. This is looking as a call option. We see the the zigzag is up. We, we've gone through the middle of the channel of the Keltner and then MACD is clearly also showing us the price is going to go up. This is a nice actually situation to enter into, um, into an option. So let's wait for the result of this and continue.
Oh, what did we just get? We just got uh, fifty-two dollars return. That was that's not too bad, actually, and nothing really changed. But as you can see, so I've made uh, another option again. But as you can see, what happens is that a lot of times. Um, you can you know what's gonna happen but then the timing is is not always correct and at this point there was just not enough time so maybe if we went with one minute uh, and a half two minutes as you can see it that's it works but the timing we almost lost the money because of the timing so it's a lot of times it's not what's gonna happen is when so that's a that's a good um, example of that so make sure to calculate your time in right as much as you can of course and here is the profit this is what was meant to be and it worked out and I'm glad we just we had this returned instead of there was just a second word went below okay so let's move on 97 dollar almost a hundred dollars already we have and we're gonna place that towards the next option guys of course mm, and let's see the next uh, doo -doo -doo, next currency to use that's actually looking pretty good Um, this one, this one, hmm, that's not too bad, that's, there is a nice downtrend, I'm gonna go with it, oh, and even better, we entered at a pullback, at the top of a pullback, that's really nice, because uh, everything else is showing that the price is gonna go down, and for us not to catch this pullback, to enter at the top of a pullback, no chance, uh, of us uh, losing now because well there is a chance but a, but a, a lot smaller chance as it's never 100% but I think we're good let's wait for the result and continue and here it is guys we got our profit and we're into the three figures finally that's awesome. Uh, as you can see, the snowball effect works the magic. We got $186 on the balance, and we're gonna keep pushing that snowball to create even even a better amount there. So we're gonna place next 186, and we're gonna choose the next scenario, next um, next situation. I keep changing between the assets because you can find sometimes you can find this perfect situation like such as this one because you had uh, a nice formed downtrend pretty strong then you have let's just place 186 then you have um, the channel you see that, that that indicates for the price to go down then you got zigzag pointing down and you got MACD pointing down that's perfect situation this actually is also looking quite good except we have the the support level there so I'm expecting for a pullback to catch a pullback here as it will be pushed by the support level uh, probably for a pullback only and then it will continue to fall down but for our time frame is enough we want to catch this pullback let's see if we can let's see if that was a correct decision and continue and great we're gonna place 350 towards the next option straight away and let's move on straight away to towards the next one um, as you can see this I don't know if it's gonna go through actually the middle because it's it's resisting there and it's more likely more likely it will go down but it might actually go through 
Mm. That's interesting. No, probably not. We're gonna go with the put option here because I don't see a, a strong growing. Uh, the last candle um, ended up lower than the last peak. So it looks like it's losing power, losing... So it looks like it's losing the strength and I think this is a... This was a good point to enter into the put option because we're expecting, with losing the power, we're expecting the price to drop. So yeah, let's wait for the result of this and continue. And here is the profit guys, $665. And we're gonna place that towards the next option. Let's see. Yeah, it's definitely gonna fall because the, it lost its strength completely. Right, this is also looking like it's going down. This is a very similar situation. I think it's going towards the middle and it's probably gonna break the middle at this point because the, the trend had lost its strength. Let's wait for the result of this and continue. And here it is, the profit from this option. We're into the four figures. Finally, guys, we're gonna stop here. This was a, an amazing session. Hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you all next time. All the best. Good luck and goodbye.